time, our camera is getting a glimpse of some of the potentially dangerous reptiles that were pulled from a home in Kenosha yesterday. Fox News and Ben Handelman shows you the snakes, the gators, the croc that are now making a new home at the Razine Zoo. This crocodile was found in a smaller kind of a homemade swimming pool. In the back of the Racine Zoo, in an area close to the public, we are getting a first-hand look at some unexpected new residents. We have um, two American alligators. The zoo is showing us some of the terrible conditions these reptiles were living in after they were found inside a Kenosha home earlier this week. Yesterday was the first time he's gotten to turn around in what we think is a long time. Maggie Tarasevich says this more than 150-pound, possibly 70-year-old alligator snapping turtle was in a tub barely larger than its body. From the crocodile to the five-foot alligators, zoo officials say the reptiles should have been nowhere near this Kenosha home. They're not common pets. They all are fairly dangerous. Kenosha police found all of the reptiles on Monday inside the home near 53rd Street and 14th Avenue. Tuesday, the Racine Zoo and the Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources removed about a dozen live reptiles. In the backyard, police say they found a dead alligator, burnt snake, and deer carcass. So far, there have been no arrests. The Racine Zoo not allowing our cameras near some of the most dangerous reptiles found who are in quarantine. Those creatures include five rattlesnakes and a poisonous lizard known as a Gila monster. But they do produce a venom. Um, they're, it's pretty slow acting, but you would definitely need to get to a hospital. Dangerous reptiles now in much safer hands. It's nice that we are able to make a difference. Well, there's still a lot of questions unanswered, like who owned these reptiles? The house was not being lived in. Cops have made contact with the homeowner, and they are saying very little else right now. Live in the newsroom, Ben Handelman, Fox 6 News. That's so bad for those reptiles. Thank you, Ben. Milwaukee police are looking for the person who shot a man just a block away from